you could very easily insert other HTML elements here inside of the app.js file. For example, you could copy this line, let me do that like that, paste it below, and now you should see two textes hello code sandbox. Also, you could add other HTML elements, for example, you could add button. Let me replace h1 here with button, and closing HTML tag will be button as well. And now I should see button with text hello code sandbox on it. That's a plain HTML tags like button, h1 and h2. Now let me demonstrate you how you could adjust the styles of the React application. At the moment there is such file as styles.css and uh, this class name here that refers to app actually takes a specific class name that is defined inside of the styles.css file. And if you remove this line or comment it out by pressing key combination command forward slash on Mac or control forward slash on Windows like that, you'll see that the styling was adjusted and now all lines are not centered anymore. Let's now uncomment this line by pressing same key combination and now all our HTML elements are centered back again because of this class name. If I remove it from here like that, you'll see again that uh, styling will not be applied. Let's now open up styles.css file and try to modify app class there. You could open up Explorer by clicking on this icon, or if you want, you could use shortcut command B on Mac or Ctrl B on Windows like that. And let's open up styles.css file. And inside of this file, I see now only single class that is called app, and there are two attribute value pairs, font family is set to sans serif, and text align is set to center. I could modify it and, uh, for example, adjust text align to right like that, and now all our elements were aligned to the right. If you want, you could try to modify, for example, color of the text by setting color attribute, and let's set its value to yellow, like this. And now text color was modified to yellow. That's how you could modify app style if you want to do so. Let's leave it as it was generated by default and let's close styles.css. That's how you could insert styles into your React application. You need to create CSS file and import it, for example, inside of the app.js file and afterwards you are able to use any class names using class name JSX attribute. Please notice, not HTML attribute, this JSX attribute. 